Hello, everyone out there in YouTube land. Um, I'm back to record part nine of my Iki Island gameplay. And here's where I left off. And I'm going to make my way in this direction in order to start this story. And then I'm going to make my way across over to here. And then I'll probably just go straight up to here and then continue the main story. So that's the goal. It might change. I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm going to bump into between here and there. But uh, we'll see. Let me double check my gear. See what I'm wearing. Okay. Check my horse. Okay. I got the horse armor on. All right. Well, let's do this. Follow the wind. Trees are beautiful. Quick stop to admire the trees. Let's go. Whoa. Huge cliff. Let's just uh climb down. Wonder if this is a story. Quick bow. Everything is cool. Don't worry. Wow, this area is just beautiful. Lightning bug and the bird. Follow the bug first, yeah? The bird's going down there, so is my little bug friend. Alright. Swing across first. Check the map. Oh, there's two unknown. I guess I'll see if I can find this one. Figure out what that is later. And then I'll continue this way. Down here. Oh yeah, well, there's a banner. Can't squeeze through that. Hmm. Memory. Okay, let's remember the past. died and not far from here.
You cheated. I don't know how, but I'm certain you did. You owe me 20 mon. <laughs> Come, let's get back to camp. Pick up the controller. I <laughs> put it down. I was taught that debts owed to swindlers are not to be honored. Hmm. I was taught there's no shame admitting defeat by a superior opponent. <laughs> Next time we compete, I would like to inspect your arrows. You bring them on. I'll bring the arrows. One last battle. One final fight. Then we begin preparations to leave this stinking island. Pardon me. I must speak with my father. Of course. Lord Shimura's stewards can collect taxes and tend the manure fields. Father, a word. Yes. Walk with me. What is it? After this campaign, don't you want to stay? Bring Iki Island under your control. It's not for me. Only in the battlefield are my homes. And you, would you stay and rule this place? I thought I would. But after everything we've been through, I feel more alive in battle than any other time. <laughs> uh, you are Sakai. What do you mean? Let the Shimuras of this world keep records and manage councils. We are the lightning in the storm. The avalanche that topples a mountain. That is Clan Sakai. I understand, Father. I once judged you soft. Unfit. Our time together has given me... Lord Sakai! Pardon my intrusion. Our scouts bring urgent news. Yes. One moment. I must go. Prepare your things. Follow my lead today. Everything will be fine. What were you going to say, Father? What did our time together give you? I've often guessed, but we'll never know. Go for it. Nah, we're here for the story, right? Mostly. I thought I heard the bug. Swing across. <clears throat> well, that's where the wind blows. real quick yeah all right Ooh. Oh, if I take that dude out this other guy's gonna see well not anymore Let's get the long range arrows Oh, I 
think that's the shaman. Well, I'm gonna get into a fight. I need to take that dude first. There are two shamans? Let's go full on ghost. Himself over here, I think. They want to play with the little samurai. Once you pissed yourself in fear, remember? You hate them too. You're not real. Getting how this ghost ability L3 R3 could use that. I have to remember that next time. Be free soon. They had me locked up for days in that thing. That was good to watch. You're safe now. See what's going on over here. We have no training. I don't even have a sword. But we can't abandon him to the Mongols. We owe him our lives. Huh. Okay. 40 meters. That must be my goal. I'm down over there. There's more smoke over there. A samurai. We have no food for you, my lord. I wouldn't accept any if you did. Not after what the Eagle Tribe did to your camp. Was anyone hurt? We were spared thanks to Doshun, the monk who oversaw this camp. He agreed to go with the Mongols peacefully if they didn't harm us. Where did they take him? We don't know, but we have people searching. I'll help. It's a rare man who would sacrifice himself for others. Hotoke can tell you where our men are searching. Her husband is leading the group. Out to this little shrine here. Oh. 
I can't believe it. It's been 15 years since I saw a samurai. You must mean Lord Sakai's men. Yes, from the invasion. There's nothing here for you to take. The Mongols have it all. I'm here to help find the monk, Doshin. You are? My husband and a few others are looking for him. They followed the Mongols toward the bridge. I'll show you. You should stay. It could be dangerous. I want to help. I owe Doshin more than most. This way. What I said earlier about the samurai? I'm sorry. The invasion took so much from me. You mean your arm? You must have been a child. War or no, that shouldn't have happened. I found a wounded samurai in our stable. Gave him food and water. My father caught me. Cut off my arm. The hand that fed the enemy, he said. That's cruel. He was wrong. No. He was right. The next night, the samurai came to our village and slaughtered everyone. It was Doshun who took me in, tended my wound. I survived because of him. I owe him my life. There's something on the path. Men have been cut down. My husband! Stay there. I'll check. I think I might be sick. Focus on breathing. This man is older. Lokoro. He left with my husband. He was new to camp. I hear noise. He's younger. There's a mark on his chin. <sighs> That's Kanaji. He had a wife and children. Do you think my husband got away? We need to find the Mongols, quickly. <sighs> Heard that arrow. Are they hiding? Return to the search area. Okay. There's something on the path. This rice. It must have come from your camp. Likely. The Mongols took all our food. Let's follow it. What would Hotoke say if she knew who you are? Mutilated, her village slaughtered, all to feed your father's arrogance. Follow the rice? You didn't answer my question about my husband. Do you think he got away? We should go as fast as we can. I'm trying. But my feet and back, I had to come. I owe Doshun everything. But if I lose my husband, I don't know what I'll do. We'll find him. I never thought I'd have a family. But then I met Togo. With him, so many things became possible. Mongols. Without him. Bunch of them Stay by the looks of it. Until I kill the Mongols. All right, time for some ghost action.
see if I can sneak up all the way. Mongols on the beach. Need a better look. Pick up a flower. Execution. No. Togo, is he hurt? I can't tell. But the Mongols will kill him if they know we're here. You can't save both. Sacrifice her husband and she falls into despair. Let the monk die and her hopes die with him. Please. You have to save them. I won't be able to save both. The moment I make a move, the Mongols will see me. When that happens... I can't lose either of them. I'll do what I can. Choose. Ah. <sighs> the husband? Man. So, this monk that she cares for, or the husband. Let's save the husband, right? the toughest looking dude down there. I'm gonna go for the shield guy here with the hallucination dart. up that let's go full go uh gear sarugami Need to be able to like deflect this. There's a parry for a reason, right? Ah, I need to practice. Okay, that's a parry right there. And I haven't played in a couple of days. Jeez, I was kind of hoping I could get in here. And use those hallucination darts to get them to like fight each other. I didn't think it would like set off a whole chain reaction. Oh well. A 
Let's make a note of that. Is it over? The hallucination darts don't work here. My lord, you saved me. You can thank your wife for that. Our family is grateful to you, but I fear for those back at camp. Doshin made sure we were fed, had medicine. Uh -oh. Is there anywhere else they can go? It's dangerous to travel, especially for us, with me being pregnant. If I had known... No, we won't risk it. We'll stay at camp. You have each other and your child. You will do well. Thank you, my lord. Come, Otoke. Let's take Doshun from the beach. Give him a funeral. You have no arrows you can gain one by successfully blocking an arrow huh well okay well i messed that one up on to the next one i mean going stealth on that mission because it was like two fronts, if you will, it was uh, very challenging. I don't know how I could have done that anywhere, any other way. All those guys are kind of like grouped together, but kind of spread apart. I don't know if I could have done that full stealth. It'd be interesting if like I could retry that, but I guess I mean I don't see any icon to like redo it. You know, like this right here. Like you can, oh wait, fast travel, replay. You could hit square and like replay that. For example, well, I guess that story, there's no replay. Can't try again. Eh, it is what it is. Moving on. Probably like some records here somewhere. Whoa, what? What? What is it? Is there a dude up on the cliff or something? Oh, is he gonna like come get me? No, well, if he comes, we'll fight him. My little bug went away. Oh, there he is. Oh, by his lonesome. No, he's here. He came over here to come find me. Enough for now. Gotcha. Must be up top of the cliff or something. Uh, let's see. Let's go this way. I wonder if it's a banner. What's this? Oh, it is a banner. It's hiding behind here. Okay. Those Mongols over there. My combat skills aren't so great right now. I could attempt to go stealth, take these guys out. I'm trying to find a high enough spot to jump off of to do like a safe landing or whatever. Maybe this will be high enough. Bam. 
Let's do it one more time. Nope. That's yeah, good enough. Alright, let's see. I mean, I could go full on stealth and infiltrate. Or, I mean, I could just start hitting him with arrows. Let's wear this till I get close enough and figure it out. And I just want to look at something real quick. Ghost Transcendent. Kind of matches the armor better than the white one, right? So I was doing white because I was kind of like trying to stick to, with the whole ghost thing because, you know, a ghost is white or translucent or whatever. That just looks cool. Let's go full trans... Uh, what do they call it? Transcendent. And what about... The headband of Tsuchima's legendary ghost. Okay, well that's why I'm wearing that headband. That's cool, let's go with that. If I could take this archer out without drawing any attention, there's a dude right next to him that'll watch him drop. Though that's good. That could be a problem. But not right there. This is the place Sugi mentioned. Where is she? More of Yamaneko's crew. I'll deal with them. Nope, somebody saw it. So much blood on your hands. Creeping around like a filthy minded criminal. Silence. No, he's wearing a helmet. I need this one. Silent. The archer. Get into cover. He's near. Where? Time for combat gear. Don't check my charms. I want. I want to maximize my. Resolve here, so let's just put back Resolve 2. Come on. What? Come on. Ah. Trying to practice my parry. With this guy. Oh, that explains why I jumped so far when I did that parry. Because I had the wind stance. Because he does. Well, not that. See how far he goes? Like, if I was just. If I just had that stance. Yeah. Well, that explains everything. I gotta remember to switch stances. What is my problem? I'm just so rusty. I was doing so much better in combat with the, uh. Not with, but when I was, you know, playing on Tsushima Island. Oh man, I'm just doing so poorly. What should, I, what I should probably do is after I'm finished with this recording this video, I should probably go somewhere like here and replay it and then like just practice my uh my parrying.
Duel of the Viper. Oh, is that where we... Yeah, I remember going there with Kenji, and I think I might have talked my way out of that fight, because I don't remember actually fighting this guy. Maybe at some point I should just, like, replay it and then just record it so I can add that to my duels playlist. Anyway. Let's continue. It. Hold still. Thank you, my lord. That was quite a sight. You're not a samurai or ronin. What exactly are you? Someone like you. Who knows what it's like to be hunted. I scouted the cove. Yamaneko's crew are trading captives for Mongol watchers. Treasonous slavers. We can't let them have more Mongol weapons. Yes. We'll need to split up. Distract the forces on the beach. I'll take a boat out. I've been slipping aboard ships undetected since I was a child. If Yamaneko is as dangerous as you say... He's my responsibility. Yamaneko is... my brother. Killing your own family... It's harder than you could ever imagine. Yes. All right. I'll head up the coast to where the Mongols and raiders are camped. Find some way to deal with them all. I can take over their watchers. And even the odds for you. Good. If we make it look like the raiders have betrayed the Mongols, they should turn on each other. I'll send you a signal of where to aim. Hmm. A little flower into their campfire will make it flare. Good luck, Sugi. Hmm. You too. Bloodletting. It sucks that she has to fight her own brother. There's a lookout post nearby. I can't leave until... I'll take care of them first. Meet me on the northern coast afterward. Some lookouts. I guess it's the opportunity to... redeem myself. See if I could do better. Three dudes back to back to back. Okay, that could be a triple kill opportunity. If I could sneak up there. Oh, this dude's looking right here. Is there a rock I can climb? There we go. Oh, there's this dude right here. I might have to just drop a smoke bomb. He didn't even notice. Alright, I guess now we sit and wait. Okay. When night falls, Sugi can row out to the ship. Better look around. Yamaneko's crew and the Mongols working together. I'll use that campfire to signal Sugi, direct her Huacha attack. This alliance ends here. Time to signal Sugi. That was a bunch of dudes. Okay, how do I do that? I 
I guess I just have to get close. Set the Mongols against Yamaneko's crew. Those guys are just chilling. Smoke bombs, right? I'm guessing we just have to drop flour in each one of these little fires. Okay. Smoke bomb, convenient. I have to sneak up to that guy. Didn't see nothing. We'll leave him alone. Two dudes just took each other out. Too bad we weren't like right here to watch it like, you know, happen. <laughs> anyway. I guess we have to find another uh, fire. Ideally without being seen. Oh, there's a fire right there, right? Supplies. Let's see, how can we get up to that fire? There's a bunch of guys up there. A bunch of guys over there. I thought I saw fire in the distance over there. I wonder what that's about. See it way over there? Take a look. Thought I saw an icon. I guess there's nothing going on over here.
There's no icon. Okay. Hmm. Let's go the long way. Take it from the top down. Drums. I wonder if there's some dudes up here too. Or if I'm hearing these guys drumming away down there. Why is that highlighted? What was that? Okay, there. I'm curious. Help! Please! Oh, we the tail. Sorry, dude. Let's see. Alright. So at least there's an icon on the map, so I'm I'm guessing that whatever I saw will probably associated with that question mark. All right, let's go. Down there. Sneak up on this dude. Good night. Alright, there's a bunch of dudes down there. Two guys up here. Three guys. I just saw that dude right now. Okay. That should set the bombs against Yamaneko's crew. Check that out. Whoa! Is there a dude chucking kunai at me? Heal up. Watch them fight. Oh, that dude's chucking stuff at me. Is that dude coming for me? Alright, how should we take this? Should we work our way down? Jump into the fight? That dude is looking for me, isn't he? Oh shit! I think it's time to jump into the fight. Whoops. Oh. 
Whoa. Is he a brute? He's a brute, right? Come on, sword sky. Ah. I really need to like practice my parry before I get into these serious fights. Yamaneko's crew will be an example to others. Don't side with the Mongols. Now to meet Sugi up the coast to the north. I need to like take a break from recording and go practice. Destroyed the ship. Suki spoke. Hope Sugi wasn't on board. A red Kasa hat. Farewell, Sugi. I wish you better fortune in the afterlife. Bomber. Kind of hoping she'd be a new ally. Sugi's hat. I should bring this to her husband in the village near the Eastern Lighthouse. That's a Thief's Rest Lighthouse. Must not have found it yet. I wonder if it's like in this area. I'll have to remember that I have that item, I guess. Put it under collections. Artifacts. Alright. Guess I'll have to remember that. Charm of Descending Talons. Oh, jump attacks can stagger and knock down enemies. Attacking from greater heights yields higher damage. Interesting. Okay. I and should a have bird. Sugi's husband. Tell him what happened. Oh, that's part of the story. Where is it? There's no guiding wind. Wow. Well, let's just go see what this is real quick. Put it on the map. Oh, that's where the bird's taking me. I forgot, that was that, those three, or six, there was two sets of three, those six uh, huts or whatever that lit up when I was using my ghost senses. And there was that guy, he was like, oh, can you help me with something? You can't climb out of this. I am always with you. Looking for redemption? You won't find it here. Deer Sanctuary. 
play. My mother loved the deer, honored them. I'll play one of her songs for them. My mother would sit us down by deer like these, and have me recite poems from Kokinshu for them. <laughs> I struggled. Whenever I faltered, she would pick up right where I left off. She knew it all by heart. Charm of Sugaru's Light. With the blessing of the deer kami, bows can shoot up to three arrows at once. When aiming a bow, it takes up to 3.5 seconds to lock onto a target's head. Mm. So if I find more deer sanctuaries, my guess is it's going to bring that bow aiming time down. That sounds kind of cool, though. Uh, three arrows. I have to... I'm, let's take a look at it now, because I will, like totally forget about it landing a headshot has a 40 percent chance to return an arrow arrows are silent hmm. those are both pretty decent charms to have all right so out of these two i mean if you're wearing this armor you might as well keep this one because when you land a headshot you can return an arrow right this increases the percent chance so that's basically equipped to help this percentage because it's 40 percent plus another 50 percent which is 20 so that brings it up to a total of 60 percent chance right so that's that's a good combination this one plus this one Arrows are silent. I guess I don't really need that one. Three arrows at once. Imagine how cool that would just be. Alright, we'll equip it. I'll put on my traveler's attire. And then I think... I think I will just leave it there. End the video. Um, if you think I need more practice... Give me a like. If you enjoyed the video, give me a like. If you're enjoying the story, give me a like. Come on, give me a like, please. Subscribe. That would be awesome. Leave a comment. Uh, leave a negative comment about how bad I'm doing. I don't care. Anyways, um, thanks for watching and uh, enjoy the rest of your day.